Hi, and welcome back to Cheeky Crypto. My name's Chris, and it's fantastic to have you back with us for another Crypto Basics video tutorial. And in today's video, we're gonna walk you through how you add MetaMask to your Ledger Nano. If you enjoy this sort of content, mash up that like button, subscribe if you haven't subscribed already, tapping that bell, selecting all the notifications so you never miss a video. And um, before you get started, um, you need to add Ethereum to your Nano Ledger. Um, so you can probably see here, we've already got that on there. Now, basically in a nutshell, um, just wanna make sure you can actually see that there, the cable's not really that long to get it on the camera but basically uh, we have done a tutorial on how to add ethereum to your nano ledger um, so yeah do check that out on the playlist crypto basics in the channel details now um, you need to first of all before actually logging into your metamask you need to be on the ethereum chain and that needs to be um, ready to go on your nano ledger uh, and it doesn't matter whether it's the x the s or the s plus they all work the same so we've now uh, gone over to our MetaMask wallet. So really straightforward. All you do, click here, go to connect your hardware wallet. We click Ledger, connect. Select your Nano X and click connect again. That is now going to come up and it's going to give you a whole list of uh, accounts that you can basically select from. So we're just going to choose the first one here and then we're going to click unlock. And there you have it. You now have Ledger 1. And if you actually click here, you now have two accounts. So it's set up a Ledger account for you through Ledger Live. It's a fantastic way to, to do it. It's dead straightforward, really simple to do. So, you know, the first things just to summarize that you should do before you actually go ahead and uh, open up your MetaMask, make sure that your Ledger is plugged in and you've uh, signed into the ETH uh account on the actual ledger itself so that's all good to go head over to your metamask uh, wallet select from the icon connecting ledger and select a wallet that is now set up and you can basically send and uh, receive crypto on that new ledger one wallet that you saw in the tutorial and um, you will need to sign the transaction additionally uh, when sending from your ledger Okay, so if you enjoyed today's video and that was helpful, mash up that like button, subscribe if you haven't subscribed already, tapping that bell, selecting all the notifications so you never miss a video and I'll catch you in the next one. Take care.